Ataku is not Fulani, Mediala reveals where XVP is from. The Mediala Kotilhor Fulani has said that the presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, PDP, Ataku Abubakar is not Fulani. The Punch reports that Saleh Al Hassan, who is the national secretary of the group, was reacting to Ataku's alleged claim that President Muhammadu Buhari is not a real Fulani. At a rally in Jigawa, Ataku reportedly said a real Fulani man would not drag his followers into extreme poverty like what is happening under the All Progressives Congress administration. Al Hassan said the fact that Ataku speaks Fulfulda does not make him Fulani. He said, the truth of the matter is that, in several places in Adamawa state, they speak Fulfulda. The fact that Ataku speaks Fulfulda doesn't make him a Fulani man. If you look at Ataku physically, he doesn't carry the biological features of a Fulani man. You look at Ataku and you see the Bantu tribe. He doesn't belong to the Sudanic tribe. Also, we don't know Ataku's uncle and all Fulani know their uncles. Have you ever seen Ataku's uncle? His claim to Fulani background is shrouded in uncertainty because nobody knows his uncles. Buhari's Fulaniness is not in doubt. His father was an Ardo, a Fulani leader. So, I think it is not an issue. The Fulani leader said his community had rejected Ataku in the elections because he doesn't share in our pains and problems, adding that the P2P candidate wanted to use our problems and campaign with them. He said, Is Ataku not responsible for the crisis on the Mambilla Plateau? They went there took over the land from the indigenous people and created mega farms and ranches, plunging them, Fulani, into poverty. If there is anybody that has created poverty, it is Ataku and the PDP. Over the 16 years they ruled this country, they virtually raped the country in a very shameful manner. It will be a disaster for Nigeria for Atiko to become president and I know God will not allow it because he doesn't mean well for the poor people in this country. Meanwhile, the director general of APC campaign organization in Yobi State speaking at the inauguration of the executives of Concerned Marketers Solidarity Forum, CMSF, for Bunny. Bra Bra and K Daija, said that People's Democratic Party has no hope in the state. The DG said that Yobi had been the comfort zone of APC and it would always be. He said that the administration strides of Governor Ibrahim Gaitam and President Muhammadu Buhari have given them reason to campaign massively and ensure the victory of the party at all levels.